मुझे खुशी है आप लोगों के बीच में आकर के I'm really glad that I'm in midst of you all. एक समय था जब मैं रेलवे प्लेटफॉर्म पर था और उस समय मैं मैं अपनी गवाही में बताऊंगा मैं रो रहा था और तब प्रभु ने कहा था ये संसार तुम्हारे लिए है मैं आपको अपनी गवाही बताऊंगा एक समय था जब मैं ओह सॉरी या दिस हैपेंस राइट या सो आई वुड लाइक टू शेयर विद यू देयर वाज अ टाइम व्हेन आई यूज्ड टू लिव इन रेलवे प्लेटफॉर्म्स and it was a difficult life and the lord actually spoke to me that i am going to give wonderful things to you aur mujhe tab pata nahi tha ki kaise ye sansar mera ho sakta hai and that time i really didn't know how can this world be mine aur aaj main dekhta hu ki pastor pritam ke dwara wo mujhe lagne laga ki ab ye sansar mera hai and now through pastor pritam i am able to see slowly that yes the world is coming to me pastor pritam thank you so much bahut bahut dhanyawad mujhe bulane ke liye aur मुझे यहाँ पर अच्छे स्वागत के लिए पास्टर प्रीतम आई रियली वांट टू थैंक यू फॉर सच अ वॉम वेलकम एंड फॉर इनवाइटिंग मी आई एम रियली ब्लेस्ड जब पास्टर प्रीतम मेरे पास 2007 में अमृतसर में आए थे हमारे घर पे तो उस समय हम बहुत ही कठिन दौर थे वाकई में ही कठिन दौर से गुजर रहे इन 2007 में पास्टर प्रीतम एक्चुअली विजिटेड मी इन अमृतसर I was really going through a real tough time, आ, real tough. मैंने उतनी खुल के बातें नहीं की थी पास्टर साहब के साथ लेकिन उसके बाद में हमारी दोस्ती एक ऐसे मुकाम पर एक ऐसे स्थान पर पहुंच गई कि अब हम दोनों मिलने चाहते थे कैसे भी At that time we did not uh, have uh, so much of close topics and talks but slowly God has made it possible that we have got closer to each other and now we are such close friends इसलिए मैं पास्टर प्रीतम को बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद देता हूं that is why i really want to thank pastor peter jo kuch pastor peter ne bataya unko main dobara repeat nahi karunga usko nahi dohraunga kyunki bahut sa hissa wo meri gawai ka bata chuke hain pastor peter has already shared a lot about me i'm not going to share the same thing because pastor peter has already shared a lot about me lekin mere paas jo kuch hai wo ye hai ki parmeshwar ek seema se pare hoke kaam karta hai all i want to say is god is limitless he works beyond boundaries yes god is limitless he works beyond boundaries amen hum usse dekhenge kaise ye hota hai let us see how god is doing that aaj jab main 6th class mein tha lagbhag 11 12 saal ka mere when i was when i was in 6th grade maybe i was at the age of 11 years old aa meri maa mujhe ek din gurudwara mein leke gayi aur bola yahi tumhari jagah hai aaj ke baad my mom took me to gurudwara and said this is where you belong mere ko kuch nahi maloom tha ye kya hota hai i didn't know anything what is this main to ek chhota sa ladka aur maine uski ungli pakdi hui aur maine kaha ab tum mujhe idhar chhod ke jaogi i was just a small kid and i looked at my mom and i said now you're going to leave me here aur main usme 6th class 6th standard mein tha usne bola ha aaj se tum yahan ke ho ye tumhara naya ghar hai yes then my mom said yes this is where you will be from now on this is aur mere ko is tarah se wo granthi ke wo jahan wahan ka jo granthi tha gurudwara ka usko de diya gaya daan kar diya gaya and this is how i was donated to the granthi mere liye to duniya hi puri alag thi For me, the whole world was totally different. Puri life, a disciplined life, thi wahan par. I had lived a whole disciplined life. So, me, sare din baje utna hai, se dekar ke raat ke sare no baje last prayer tak koi puri niyam ke anusar chalne wala jivan tha. The life was like waking up early in the morning, 3:30 a.m. and then sleeping at 10:30 p.m. and throughout this time, I had a disciplined Asal life. Asal me, wo gurudwara ek seminary thi, six seminary aur gurudwara dono tha. एक्चुअली वो गुरुद्वारा एक सिख सेमिनरी और गुरुद्वारा दोनों की था दैट गुरुद्वारा वाज एक्चुअली अ सिख सेमिनरी एज वेल एज अ गुरुद्वारा वो मेरी प्लस टू वहां पर खत्म हुई और इधर मैं पास इधर मैं ग्रंथि बना and then i was just uh, in india we call it matriculate uh, sorry intermediate i just passed uh, passed into uh, plus 2 and i just joined there और मेरे को उसके बाद में प्रिस्ट बना दिया गया और मैं अब एक ग्रंथि के रूप में काम कर रहा हूं और फिर वहां पर मुझे एक ग्रंथि के रूप में Okay, and then I was just uh, passed on there to be the granthi of the Amritsar Gurudwara, and that it was. लेकिन उन इन सब चीजों में एक चीज हो गई, जितना मैं ज़्यादा अपने ग्रंथ को पढ़ता था, उतना ज़्यादा मेरे अंदर परमेश्वर को जानने की भूख पैदा होती थी. But there was something that was happening in all this thing. That was the more I went through all this learning, I was more curious to know about the real God. और मैं बहुत रोता था और मैं कहता था ये ईश्वर कहाँ है? ये मन में शांति क्यों नहीं है? मैं इतना दुखी क्यों अपने आप में? And I used to cry and say, Lord, where are you? Where are you? Why am I sad? Why can't I have you in me and have that peace? और तब एक दिन रात के समय जब मैं गुरुद्वारे से आया और मैं कुछ काम कर रहा था मैंने वहाँ पर के ऊपर खिड़की के ऊपर एक किताब को देखा जिसका नाम था प्रेम का संदेश 
And then one day when I returned from the Gurudwara, I saw in the window there was a book which was saying the Meth Prakasa. मेरी बहन उस प्रेम के सने प्रेम दे सने उन्हों वो पढ़ रही थी। My sister was actually reading that New Testament book। उसमें उसमें पेन रखा और यहूना सात सैती सर्तीस को अंडरलाइन कर दिया लाल रंग से। And then my sister actually took a pen and he underlined John seven thirty one thirty two। और दूसरे दिन जब मैं कुछ कर रहा था तो मैंने फिर से उसको उठा लिया और मैंने वहाँ पर इन शब्दों को पढ़ा। तब यीशु ने पुकार कर जो मुझ पर विश्वास करेगा जैसे पवित्र शास्त्र में लिखा है उसके हृदय से पंजाबी में अमृत जल दिया नदियां वहां निकल अमृत जल की नदी निकल आई बहने लगेंगी जॉन सेवन थर्टी वन थर्टी सेवन थर्टी एट थर्टी सेवन थर्टी एट and then the second day again I came and I saw that book still there and then it, the pen was there and it was pointing to a verse in Bible in John 7 37 32 and it said like this on the last day, the great day of the feast, Jesus stood and cried out, saying, If anyone thirsts, let him come to me and drink. He who believes in me, as the scripture has said, out of his heart will flow rivers of living water. And as I read these words, one of the words came back to me. I am the Amr Jalu, who can give you your love. The moment I read this scripture, a voice came from behind me and it was saying, I am that living water. मैंने पीछे देखा उधर तो मुझे कोई दिखाई नहीं दिया। I just turned back and I saw no one was there। और फिर से वो आवाज़ आई। मैं वो उम्रित जनु जो तेरी प्यास बुझा सकता है। And then again I heard that same voice। I saw behind no one was there and I again heard the word which says, I am that living water। If anyone thirsts, come and drink me and he will never be thirsty। और मैंने उस किताब से एड्रेस नोट किया और मैं अगले दिन पास्टर जी के पास पहुंच गया। I just pointed out to where it was written in the scripture and I came to pastor the next day. And I was very happy, I am a very good person, I am a very good person, I am a Gurdwara Granthi, and I am a very good person, if you know me, tell me about it too. So I told the pastor, I am also like a Granthi in the Gurdwara, just like you are the pastor of the church, and I am also looking for the real God, and if you know, just share it with me. He said, okay, come here, you will get to the Sunday church, you will get to the Sunday church. The pastor said, okay, no problem, you can come here every Sunday and you will find God. And then it was nine months, nothing happened really, and, but I also finished the entire New Testament, but nothing happened. तो मैंने वो निकाली और उसको जाके दिखाया गिन्नी मेरे को ईश्वर दो नहीं तो तुम भी मरो मैं भी मूर्ख बना रहा हूँ तुम भी मूर्ख बना रहे हैं चलो दोनों चलते हैं ऊपर की ओर। I was losing my patience so I took my sword you all know Sikhism we have sword so I took the sword and I went to the pastor and said look I'm really losing my patience now I'm going to kill you also and I'm going to kill myself also you are also making fool of yourself and you are I'm also making fool of myself so let's both I, I'll just kill and let's go to our God the pastor was really scared he wrote the sinner's prayer and said okay uh, here is the sinner's prayer go home read this prayer and you will find God I what I felt was okay. He is again making a fool of me, but I said no worries. I'll just take the slip, go home, and I still have one day. Anyhow, I am going to die soon. पहले भी दो बार मैं आत्महत्या का प्रयास कर चुका था, मरा तो नहीं था. तो अब की बार मैंने कहा अब की बार इसको भी लेके साथ जाऊँ. Earlier two times I had already tried committing suicide, I could not succeed and this time I thought now when I commit suicide I will take this pastor also with me. <laughs> so I went to my room and what happened was I started praying this one and something from behind came like a big light. Uh, no, not something from behind, something just coming from side and he came, he came and sat 
Okay, it's a long robe, white robe, long hair, with a good, great razor for coming out, and it was shining. And he, while entering, he just said, "I am the living water who can quench your thirst." I think my English is better than his. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord. Pastor, the pastor's English is better than mine. Hallelujah! You tell me in Hindi. Okay. So I think uh, I already you already said in Hindi and English both. So it is done. Did I? वो मेरे साथ बैठे रहा मुझे नहीं मालूम उन्होंने क्या बातें की लेकिन सुबह तक मेरे लिए सब कुछ बदल चुका वो द पर्सन केम टू मी एंड ही सैट बिसाइड मी एंड ही स्पोक टू मी आई डोंट रियली डोंट रिमेंबर व्हाट ही स्पोक टू मी बट व्हेन आई वोक अप इन द मॉर्निंग एवरीथिंग वाज चेंज मेरा छोटा भाई आया और वो दरवाजा खटखटा रहा है क्योंकि लगभग सुबह के 9 बज चुके हैं My younger brother, he came and he was knocking at the door because it was already 9 a.m. in the morning. मैं तो साढ़े तीन बजे उठने वाला व्यक्ति अभी नौ बजे तक क्यों नहीं उठा? इसलिए वो लोग परेशान हो गए. I used to wake up in the morning 3:30 a.m. and today I had not woken up at 9 a.m. So he was really worried. What happened? वो नौक करता रहा और बोलता रहा रे निकलो बाहर तुम्हें आज तुम क्या हो गया अभी तुम अभी तक कुछ काम क्यों नहीं किया अभी तक तुम गए भी नहीं है पूजा पाठ भी नहीं किया है क्या हो गया है? He was knocking at the door and saying, "What happened? What happened? You are not waking up. You have to do so much of rituals and all the praise and worship and things like that." And when I was standing up, I was a changed person. I had a strange experience that I can't tell you. But I felt that something has happened to me. Amen. 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 I am changed. Kuch to ho gaya. Something has happened. Something has happened to me. Something has happened to me. Kuch to ho gaya. Ye to main nikal ke aaya kamre se baar. Mera bhai niche baitha tha. Wo uthke khada hua. Mujhe dekhte usne apni aankhein chupai bola. Tumhara chehra surya ki tarah chamak raha hai. Ja kar dekho tumhe kuch ho gaya. When I came out my younger brother he was down and he saw me he said something has happened to you. your face is shining like a sun. Go and see something has happened to you. Or mujhe to pata hi tha something has already happened here. And I already knew that something has already happened. I main niche bhag kar ke aaya aur maine wahan kam mirror mein dekha kuch bhi nahi kuch to dikhai nahi diya mujhe par mujhe pata tha main andar se pura badal chuka hu. So mujhe pata tha mere paas ek gehri shanti hai. I ran to the mirror and looked. I could not see anything different in myself, but I knew something has already happened, and I have already received what I was looking for. Or मेरे मुँह से कोई अजीब भाषा भी निकल रही है. And there was something strange tongue coming out of my mouth. मेरी बहन ने मेरे भाई को देखा. उसको बोला तुम्हारी आँखों को क्या हुआ? वो बोला मैंने इसको देखा. तो मेरी आँखें ऐसी होगी मैं तो देख ही नहीं पा रहा हूँ. उसकी आँखें लाल होगी. हमको उसको हॉस्पिटल एडमिट करना पड़ा. My sister came and he asked the younger brother, "What happened to your eyes? It's all red." He said, "I just looked at him, and now my my eyes are in difficult situation, so they had to take him to the hospital." कहानी को छोटा बनाता हूँ. एक साल के बाद मैं पास्टर जी के पास फिर मेरा चाकू लेके पहुँच गया. Summary. Uh, after a, a year, I went to the same pastor, taking a knife. Baptisma do. I told him I want to be baptized. नहीं तो अब की बार फिर जाओगे मेरे साथ. Give me baptism, or else you are again coming with me. वो मुझे ऊपर से नीचे देखा, उसका पूरा टांग पाँव हिलने लगा, बोला तुमको बत्तीस मार देना है क्या बोले? He he looked at me and he was shaking and he said, yes, I have to baptize you. मैं समझ गया ये तो कठोर व्यक्ति है, ये मुझे बत्तीस मार नहीं देने वाला. He looked at me and he decided he knew that he, this person he's a he's a difficult person. He's not going to baptize. लेकिन मैंने लेना ले लिया था, जिसके पीछे मैंने जिसको मैंने जान लिया है, उसके पीछे मैं चल के रहू But I had already decided in my life that the person whom I have known, I am going to follow him throughout my life. जिससे मैं बात करता हूँ, अब उसके साथ मुझे चलना ही है. The one who I am talking to, I am going to follow him throughout my life. तो मैं घर में आ गया, मैंने अपने बाथरूम में टब को भरा और खुद को ही बपतिस्मा दिया यीशु मसीह के नाम में, अपने आप को डुबकी लगा के भरा दिया. I went to the bathroom. I had a tub filled with water. I baptized myself, and I said, "In the name of Jesus, I'm baptizing me." Oh, my father's name. मैं वापस आके पास्टर जी को बोला हमको बपतिस्मा हो गया। I again went back to the pastor and said I am already baptized। वो बोला कैसे हो गया? He asked how। मैंने बोला खुद को दिया अपने आप को दिया पिता पुत्र को इकरात्मा के नाम में दे दिया हो गया। He uh, and I said to the pastor in the name of Father, Holy Spirit and the Son I have baptized वो बोला नहीं नहीं ऐसा नहीं होता है मैं दूंगा बपतिस्मा लेकिन अगर तुम इस सारे पहनावे को बदल के आओ 
the pastor said, no, no, this is not how we baptize. If you want to baptize, I will baptize you. And the first thing you have to do is whatever you are wearing right now, you have to change your attire and come back. Yes, it's very for a person who is born in Sikhism, it is a difficult thing and a big challenge for him to cut his hair, change his attire. This means that you have your identity, your life, your life, your life. It means that you are going to defy your identity, your true thing that you were born in and now you are going to defy it completely. So I just asked the pastor, okay, if I go and do all these things, what you are asking for me, that I'll change my attire, I'll cut my hair and all, then will you baptize me? I'm going to fast track my story. So I got baptized. I went to my home. My parents and my relatives, they saw me, uh, they saw me that I have cut my hair and I changed my attire. The first thing I received was a big slap. They had no issue if I was still in that same appearance and look and feel and I would have accepted Christ. But the thing they could not bear was that I had changed my identity. And then uh, the persecution really started. I had five brothers and all. Five brothers? Yeah, there were five brothers and sisters. And then the, my mother used to give an order and then they used to just hit me like a person will hit a football. I used to have beard. People used to hold my beard and drag me. And I used to it, the beatings were really so bad that sometimes I had to have a plaster and then for the whole month I used to be in the plaster. For me, seeing myself bleeding was a daily affair. So all these persecution continued to happen. Pastor Pitam already shared a bit. I'm not going to go much deeper. I'll just share one more thing and we'll go into the word. One day my whole family uh, assembled. This episode was gun shooting last episode. There was a lot of episodes, but it was the last episode. This is one of the last incidents that happened after the gun shooting. This was the third attempt for my life. This was the third attempt when people attempted to take my life. I was 6 years old and I was going to follow Prabhu and I was going to kill you and I was going to kill you. It had now been six years when I had been persecuted, I had been beaten for following Jesus Christ. Christian used to say that please don't come to me because when you come to me, persecutions also follow you. Two times I was dragged out of the church by the pastor saying that please just leave this place because because of you we are persecuted. I didn't know much details about what is the Catholic Church or a Pentecostal Church. Even the Catholic Church dragged me out of the church. And then uh, this again same thing happened for the third time. I was just in midst of my family member and my third brother. He just brought a big sword. It was around 6 p.m. in the evening. All my documents, this one by one, they burned everything. They had already uh, handwritten from me that they will, I'm not going to participate or have a share in any of the projects. I didn't share all that earlier, but you can remember now, you can think that that evening all the documents were burned. Now I had no identity of myself. Because of you, we have faced a lot of shame and now 
जस्ट रन अवे फ्रॉम दिस बिकॉज वी आर गोइंग टू इशू फतवा अगेंस्ट यू लेकिन ये तो मेरी माँ के शब्द है मेरा भाई बोलता है हम तो इसको अब भी इधर ही खत्म करेंगे दिस वॉज वॉट माई मदर वॉज थिंग माई ब्रदर वॉज एक्चुअली सिंग वी आर गोइंग टू किल यू राइट नाउ लेकिन जब उस मारपीट में ये सब जब चल रहा था उन्होंने मेरे सारे कपड़े उतार लिए Uh, and on these things, then it was going through the beating and everything. They opened, they just took all of my clothes. मेरी उम्र लगभग तेईस चौबीस साल की थी उस समय. I was twenty three or twenty four years old that time. बिल्कुल young man और मुझे फिर इतना मारा उन्होंने मार के मारते मारते जब तलवार मेरे मेरे ऊपर चलाने लगे तब मेरी मम्मी ने मुझे नीचे धक्का दिया first floor से मैं नीचे गिरा और फिर अंधेरे में भाग करके वहाँ अपने एक मित्र के पास गया. And and then and then they were just beating me non-stop, non-stop, and I was bleeding and all. And then they raised the sword and they was about to just kill me. That time my mother actually pushed me from level two to level one, and then she asked me to just run away. And I was running 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 away. And I was से भी चले जाओ यहाँ पर भी मारेंगे आपको माई फ्रेंड एक्चुअली ही गेव मी समी एंड मी द प्लीज लीव दिस प्लीज ऑल्सो बिकॉज इफ यू आर हियर दे आर प्लेटफॉर्म पर आकर के बैठा हुआ था और मैं रोने लगा वे वो ट्राई कौन ना हो तो थ्री एम इन द मॉर्निंग आई वॉज इन द रेलवे प्लेटफॉर्म एंड आई वॉज लॉर्ड वेयर शेल आई गो मैंने कहा मेरे को मेरा कौन मुझे कौन खाना देगा I said, Lord, who is going to feed me? I will never be alone in my life. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house was burned. Okay, you have been with me when my house I have nothing with me. What shall I do? I was sitting on the station and crying. I was crying. I had only $23 for the ticket to Delhi. It was just about to be $23. Rupees. I was just crying at the platform. I had $23. Rupees. Uh, it was just enough to go to Delhi. And then the permission came with a great strength. And then I received the word of the Lord. And then I received the word of the Lord. And then I received the word of the Lord. And then I received the word of the Lord. This is in Job 23. Please listen carefully. And दूसरा वचन है ये कौन है जो अज्ञानता की बातें कहकर युक्ति को बिगाड़ना चाहता है? Consider this word. Who? Yeah, uh, Job 23. Yeah, verse two. Verse two. So this was the word which I received in Job 23 too. Even today my complaint is bitter. My hand is listless because of groaning. No, is it? No, 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 no. This is 22. Yeah, 38. I said 38 too. 38 too. Yeah. Who is he? Who is destroying the counsel of God? It is something like that. Yeah, Job thirty-eight two. Who is this who darkens the counsel by the words without knowledge? ये KJV version है, लेकिन एक version में लिखा है, Who is he? Who is going to destroy the plan of God? Who is that that obscures my plans with the word without knowledge? Hindi में बहुत अच्छा है युक्ति, यानी formula. ये कौन है? जो परमेश्वर के एक फॉर्मूले को बिगाड़ना चाहता है। He who is this person who is going to destroy the formula or the knowledge of the word of God itself? और तब उसने कहा, मैं तुझसे प्रश्न करने वाला हूँ, verse three. And then the verse told me, I am going to ask you. जब मैंने पृथ्वी की नींद डाली, तब तू कहाँ था? Where were you when I laid the earth's foundation? Tell me if you understand. और तब परमेश्वर ने कहा, इसका मतलब ये है कि तू कहाँ था जब मैं तेरे साथ स The revelation for this was God was saying me, where were you when I was, where were you uh, when I was in together with you wherever you went I was there with you. और तब बजन और तब इशाया छासन के वो बजन मुझे याद है आकाश मेरा सिंहासन है. तब तब then I remembered the words from the Isaiah which says sixty six one sixty six one आकाश मेरा सिंहासन है और पृथ्वी मेरे पांव की चोंकी है. Isaiah 61. Yeah, 66. One. 66. Yes, heaven is my throne and earth is my footstool. Footstool. Earth is my footstool. अबे कौन हो तुम? तुम भूल गया? ये संसार मैंने तुमको. The world is mine. The world is yours. Heaven is my throne and earth is my footstool. Where yes. is the house you will build for me? बच गए. प्रिति. ये आकाश अब से तेरा तेरे लिए छत है और ये घर ये प्रिति तेरे लिए अब से तेरा घर है. This sky, this heaven is going to be your home, and this earth that you see now, this is going to be your home. I looked up 
and I looked down and I said, God, how is that going to be? मैं ऊपर देखा और फिर नीचे देखा मैंने कहा परमेश्वर ये कैसे मुमकिन है I do not know, Lord, how this is going to be. I don't, मुझे पता नहीं परमेश्वर ये कैसे संभव होगा परमेश्वर ये कैसे मुमकिन है कौन मुझे खिलाएगा कौन मेरी सेवा टहल करेगा कहा मेरा घर होगा मेरे पास तो अपना आइडेंटिटी कार्ड भी नहीं है मैं क्या करूंगा परमेश्वर परमेश्वर ने मुझसे फिर से कहा कि मैं तुम्हें पहले ही बता चुका हूँ ये आकाश तुम्हारा छत होगा और ये पृथ्वी तुम्हारा बिस्तर Years we do not have bed even in our home till today because I had heard that voice and I still want to practice that voice. Now, अब ये तीस साल हो गया है आज के घर में आज के दिन भी मेरे घर में बिस्तर नहीं है क्योंकि मैं उस आवाज को फॉलो करना चाहता हूँ जो उसने मुझ दिन बातचीत करी थी कि ये आकाश तेरा छत और ये पृथ्वी तुम्हारा बिस्तर होगा. तीन साल पहले हम मैं और मेरी पत्नी बाजार में थी. Three years ago, myself and my wife, we were at the market. हमने तेईस बार घर बदला किराए के मकान में रहते हुए. We have changed twenty-three times uh, our homes while renting our home. और मैंने वो सब्जी वाले को कहा, मैंने मेरी wife को कहा, राधा जी, आज हमें कैप्सिकम खाने का मन है, आप खिला दीजिए please. Actually, she handles the house plates. So I told my wife that uh, today, oh, I, yeah, today I feel like eating uh, peppers. So can you please cook peppers and I want to have it. And she looked at me. She said, no, the budget doesn't allow to eat capsicum. So my, <laughs> so my wife told me, no, our budget does not allow us to have peppers. And this, uh, this, uh, the, the seller says, sir, you look so rich. And my wife says, we don't look rich, but our budget doesn't allow us. The, the vegetable seller, he said, sir, you, the, you look really rich, and, but our look and appearance, don't be deceived by that, we are not really rich. And then I said, sir, you do not. I just said laughingly, you do not. Oh, we still sleep on the floor. We don't have bed even. तब मैंने मजाक में उस सब्जी बेचने वाले से कहा कि तुम्हें तो ये पता नहीं हमारे पास तो बिस्तर भी नहीं है मैं तो ज़मीन में सोता हूँ. A rickshaw driver was standing and he heard that and he said, how does it possible? I don't believe. I said, okay, you bet upon me. So then uh, there was a rickshaw puller. He said, how is it possible? I don't believe it. So he paid hundred rupees bet with me. So he uh, bet on me. He gave. He, रिक्शे वाले ने कहा कि ठीक है ये सौ डॉलर सौ रुपए मैं तुम्हारे ऊपर लगाता हूँ और देखता हूँ तुम्हारे दावे को आज मैंने कहा He was uh, he was totally amused and he could not believe himself that he could not see a bed there. He saw that we were living in a bed on the floor. First level बोल दे तो first level पे हम रहते थे. So in uh, we used to live in level two. हाँ अच्छा हाँ first अच्छा okay first floor. तो मैंने मैंने कहा मैंने कहा sir आप अभी भी शर्त जीत गए हैं. So uh, then I told him don't worry brother you have still won the bet. आप जानते हैं मैं अभी भी धरती से पंद्रह फुट ऊपर रहता हूँ बिकॉज आई एम स्टिल नॉट इन द फ्लोर ऑफ द एक्चुअल लेवल वन आई एम स्टिल फिफ्टीन फीट अब लेवल वन सो यू वन एक्चुअली वो बहुत खुश हो गया बोला ये कैसा जीवन है मुझे भी बताओ सो ही सेट दैट Uh, I'm really amused. What kind of life is this? Please tell me. और तब मैंने उस रिक्शा पुलर को यीशु मसीह के बारे में बताया हमने चाय भी पिलाई So that was the time when I actually shared the word of God to that rickshaw puller, and I was so happy. So who is that person who is going to change this thing? I said, "Okay, okay, Prabhu. If this is your duty, if this is your counsel, if this is your plan, if this is what you are designed for me, then that's fine. I'm going to take up a life of monk." So Parmeshwar, I have Parmeshwar. Parmeshwar, if this is your duty. तो कोई बात नहीं मैं आपकी युक्ति के हिसाब से ही चलूंगा और जैसा आप चाहते हैं वैसा ही करूंगा ठीक है चैनल चेंज हो जाता है थोड़ा बियर कीजिएगा अभी तक पंजाबी नहीं आया चैनल वो भी आएगा उसके 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 बाद बाद में मैं मंक का रूप ले लिया और पूरे इंडिया में घूमने लगा उसके आफ्टर दैट आई जस्ट हैड फॉलोड द रोल ऑफ अ साधु एंड आई वॉज जस्ट ट्रेवलिंग अराउंड द कंट्री आप मेरे फोटोज देख सकते हैं पास्टर प्रीतम ने वेबसाइट में डाले हुए 
You can have a look at some of the photographs Pastor Pritam has put on his website. And then one day I was just uh, walking in Bangalore in the evening and I was just uh, used to do that by sharing the word of God and I saw South India Bible College. So I thought I might find some food so I just went there. और वहां पर पहुंचने के बाद में मेरे को वहां मैंने उनको बोला प्रिंसिपल साहब को बच्चा कुछ खाने के लिए भोजन दे दो सो आई वेंट टू द प्रिंसिपल एंड आई जस्ट सेड डू यू हैव समथिंग फॉर मी चाइल्ड गिव मी सम फूड बिकॉज़ आई वाज मॉम आई यूज्ड टू बिहेव दैट वे ओह चाइल्ड या बच्चा कुछ खा ले सो आई वाज बिहेविंग लाइक अ मंक सो आई वेंट टू द प्रिंसिपल एंड आई सेड चाइल्ड डू यू हैव समथिंग टू ईट आई एम हंग्री ओके टू कट शॉट कारी सुनने के बाद उसने कहा साधु जी हम आपको यीशु मसीह के बारे में और ज्यादा सिखाना चाहते हैं When he heard my story, he said, uh, "Mr. Monk, what we have heard from you, so we are going to teach more about the Word of God to you." लेकिन उससे पहले मुझे ये पता लगाना आप अंदर कैसे आ गए? But before that, I want to know how did you come in? मैंने कहा अंदर गेट से आया और कैसे आएंगे? So I told him that I just followed the gate. किसी ने नहीं देखा आपको मैंने बोला मुझे नहीं मालूम. So he asked me, "No one noticed you?" वहाँ एक रजिस्टर था उसने साइन किए मैंने बोला किसी ने मुझे बताया ही नहीं. So then I asked. Uh, so the principal asked me, "There is a register where we have to sign when you come in. No one asked you." उसने तीनों गेट में से बुला लिए. So he called men from three different gates. उसने उसने first level के कुछ अपने teachers भी ऊपर second level पे बुला लिए. So then he called some uh, teachers from level one also to the level two. और वो सबसे पूछने लगा ये 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 साधु जी अंदर कैसे आ गए? And then he started asking each and every officials, "How did this monk come inside?" क्या करके ये कौन है जो युक्ति को बिगाड़ना चाहता है? Just remember who is this person who is going to destroy his own council. और मैं सर ने उन सब की आंख को बंद कर दिया क्योंकि परमेश्वर मुझे वहाँ कुछ समय के लिए शांति के साथ रहने के लिए चाहता था. The Lord actually closed their eyes for a while so that I can come to this place. प्रभु की प्लान था उसकी योजना थी कि मैं बाइबल कॉलेज में जाके प्रभु के बारे में और अधिक सीख सकूं क्योंकि मेरे को अच्छी तरह से डिसाइपल नहीं बनाया गया था. It was the planning of the God that I was in that place so that I can go and have a formal training of the Bible. जब वो उन सब को पूछने लगा तो मैं 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 डरने लगा ये तो अभी पुलिस के हवाले करेंगे लोग. When they were, he was just inquiring everyone. I was a bit scared. I felt that he is going to handle me, hand me over to the police. किसी ने मुझे आते हुए नहीं देखा और कहीं मैंने रजिस्टर में साइन नहीं किए तब तो ये बोल रहे वो बोल रहे ये तो कूद करके अंदर आ गया. He jumped on the wall and came here. So, he I, so he never actually, so I never actually made an entry in any register and all. So it was just like I had trespassed and I came in. मैं खड़ा हो गया मैंने बोला आप ही मुझे चाहे तो मुझे कुछ खाना वाना देख चाहिए। So I told everyone, okay, it's okay, just let me go. I don't want to eat anything. But that driver said the Lord was very, बहुत बहुत अच्छे थे उन्होंने कहा रुको 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 हम आपको बाइबल के बारे में बताएंगे। So they were really kind. They said, don't worry, just stay here. We are going to tell you about the word of God. और तब उसने इस तरह उसने मुझे कहा पर तो यहाँ पर सब इंग्लिश में है। So then he said that uh, yeah we want to share uh, with you all this thing but here everything is in English. मैं उन्नतीस साल उम्र है, 29 उम्र मेरी उम्र है उस समय और उस समय मेरे को बोल रहे हैं अंग्रेजी सीखना पड़ेगा. And so that time I was 21, 29 years old and that time I didn't know English and they were saying that now it is the time you have to actually learn first English. मेरी हिंदी भी उतनी अच्छी नहीं थी शुरुआत पंजाब पंजाबी मेरी बहुत फ्लुएंट थी. That time even my Hindi was not so good. I was I was only fluent in Punjabi. तो मुझे एक बात बताओ क्या तुमको यीशु के बारे में सीखना है दे ओनली आस्क मी वन क्वेश्चन डू यू वांट टू नो अबाउट जीसस क्राइस्ट मैंने बोला ठीक है सीखना है चलो इंग्लिश भी सीखेंगे so, अगर यही भाषा यीशु को आती है तो सीखेंगे सो आई जस्ट टोल्ड हिम ओके आई एम गोइंग टू लर्न इंग्लिश इफ इंग्लिश इज व्हाट नीड्स फॉर मी टू नो द वर्ड ऑफ गॉड आई एम गोइंग टू लर्न इंग्लिश एक साल पहले वो इंग्लिश सिखाया मुझे सो द फर्स्ट ईयर दे टॉट मी इंग्लिश और अभी तो खैर प्रभु की दया से अभी 20 साल हो गए इंग्लिश को यूज करते हुए And now it has been 20 years. Now I have been using English, and you can see how he is well in English. But one thing we know, one thing we tell, we don't have anything. We don't have any identity. So one thing I want to share that we don't have any identity. We don't have any identity. We don't have any wealth. We don't have any identity. 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 मैं अपने आप से पूछ लेगा क्या मैं दे सकता हूं प्रभु दूसरे को मेरे पास क्या है जिसने मैं कयो को आशीष पहुंचाई है आई आई कैन आस्क माय सेल्फ लॉर्ड व्हाट इज दैट आई हैव दैट आई कैन गिव टू समवन टू ब्लेस समवन कुछ ऐसी बातें है पॉलस ने भी कही है दिस इज समथिंग सिमिलर व्हिच पॉलस द व्हिच पॉल एक्चुअली टोल्ड हां उसको देखते हैं दूसरा कुंजियो 6 अध्याय और 9 10 वचन 
आइए हम लोग उसे देखें दूसरा क्रंथियस दूसरा क्रंथियस छह अध्याय नौ और दस वचन सिक्स नाइन एंड टेन अच्छा वहाँ अंग्रेजी में उतना साफ नहीं है इसलिए मैं हिंदी में पढ़ूंगा लेकिन हम उसका लिटरल ट्रांसलेशन करेंगे इंग्लिश में सो वी आर गोइंग टू रीड इट नाउ अनजानों के जैसे हैं No, not regarded as हमें कोई नहीं जानता है नो वन नो दस जब तक मैं प्रभु में नहीं था मुझे कोई नहीं जानता था सिवाय एक छोटे से गुरुद्वारे के सौ लोग Unless I knew the word of God, no one knew me. लेकिन जैसे जैसे मैं बुलाया यीशु के साथ हुई But the moment I came to know Christ, newspaper में आने लगा I was in the newspaper. हर जगह CID वाले आए घर आकर के पूछ रहे तुम क्यों कन्वर्ट हो गया CID uh, the crime investigation bureau also came to my past uh, to me at my home and asked me why did you decided to accept Christ police ne pakad liya le ja ke court mein khada kar diya court mein case chala diya tum kyu prabhu ko grahan kar liya hai the the police actually took me to the court and asked what made you accept Christ us aisi kuch baat ko yaad likh raha hai anjano ke jaise hain Paul is saying something similar in this verse he is saying we are like unknowns lekin to bhi prasiddh hain Still we are known, we are famous. We are famous. हम प्रसिद्ध हैं. We are famous. हम प्रसिद्ध हैं. फिर कहता है मर्तों के जैसे हैं, मरने वाले हैं, कब मर जाएं कोई पता नहीं. The next verse is dying and yet will live on. लेकिन फिर भी जीवित हैं. Yet will live on. तीन बार कोशिश की मारने की. Three times I was uh, they they tried to kill me. एक बार उन्होंने बंदूक से मारने की कोशिश की. First time they tried to kill me with a bullet. एक बार उन्होंने डंजन में डाल दिया. वो भी डंजन कैसा? आप समझ गए सीवर वाला द सेकंड टाइम दे एक्चुअली थ्रू मी इनटू द ड्रेन व्हिच वाज अ सीवर ड्रेन जहां से आप जहां पर एक घंटा भी रहना पता नहीं क्या होता है यू कैन जस्ट इमेजिन लिविंग देयर फॉर वन आवर और वहां पर बैठ करके अपने आप को गर्म करने के लिए गीत कौन सा गा रहे हैं हम आई हैव डिसाइडेड टू फॉलो जीसस नॉट टर्निंग बैक एंड नॉट टर्निंग बैक and in that place uh, in the midst of that sewer when i was feeling cold i was just singing a song what was that song i have decided to follow jesus no turning back no turning back actually socha tha yahi par ab khatam ho jayenge i actually thought this is the place where i'm going to die aur teesri baar talwar lekar ke aage third time they came with a sword lekin abhi bhi dekhiye main jeevit hu aapke saath still you can see his hallelujah 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 yahi to paulus keh raha hai this is what paulus said paulus keh raha hai कोई भी नहीं जानता हमें पॉलिस इज सेइंग नॉट नो वन नोस अस लेकिन हम प्रसिद्ध हैं स्टिल वी आर फेमस हां हम मरतों के जैसे बंदे कब मर जाए मारू नहीं है वी आर डाइंग वी आर लाइक डाइंग येट वी लिव ऑन लेकिन देखो हम जीवित हैं स्टिल सी वी आर मैं अभी और कहानी को छोटा कर रहा हूं वचन 10 में कंगालों के जैसे हैं परंतु बहुतों को धनवान बना देते हैं आई एम मेकिंग टू आई एम कटिंग शॉर्ट एंड यू कैन सी इन वर्स 10 इट सेज poor poor yet making many rich we are poor yet we are making many rich the word jo shabd yahan par istemal hua hai wo hua hai bankrupt kangal the word which is used here is bankrupt hindi mein uske liye ek aur shabd aaya hai agar aap hindi jante hain to aap pakad lenge than than gopal hai hum if if you know hindi you know the word than than gopal means we are empty handed we are bankrupt ek bhi penny jeb mein nahi hai batwa tak nahi hai We don't have a single penny. We don't even have a wallet. हमारे पास कुछ भी नहीं है. We have nothing. लेकिन कुछ तो है. But still we have something. और वो जो कुछ है उससे दूसरों को धनी बना रहे हैं. And the thing that I have, it is sufficient enough to make us rich. जो होगा आप उसी से दूसरे को धनी बनाएंगे. What you have is the what what you have is the thing that you are going to use to bless others. लेकिन जब चेले यीशु के पास आए तो उनके साथ भी कुछ तो हो गया. When the disciples actually came to Jesus Christ, something happened to them also. Something to kuch hoi gaya tha unke saath. Something happened with them. Dekhe yahan par kya likha hai? Let's see what is it. Reto ke kaam teesre adhyay mein. In Acts three. Yahan par Petrus bolta hai, chandi aur sona to nahi hai mere paas. Here Peter is saying, I don't have silver or gold. Ha, mere paas nahi hai. Par agar jo kuch mere paas hai. Why am I to give it to you? I don't have silver or gold, but whatever I have, I am going to give it to you. Yesu ke naam mein uth aur chal phir. In the name of Jesus, rise and start walking. Ab dekhe kya ho gaya? Bade maje ki baat hai. Ye utha aur chala phira nahi. Bachan aad bolta hai. Jumping, kud ne phand ne laga. And then you can see he was not even walking. He started jumping. Aur Parmeshwar ki stuti karta hua chala gaya. 
and then he started praising the name of the lord and he just went away patras aur jumna ke paas dene ke liye paisa nahi tha peter and john didn't have any money to give lekin inke paas jo tha wohi aisa tha jo usko changa kar gaya but whatever he had that was sufficient to actually heal that person ye janam se langda hai he was lame by birth ye janam se langda ke udhar hi pada hua hai he was lame by birth and he was just lying there iske ummeed hi nahi ki ki main bhi kabhi chal phir sakunga he never has anticipated that he will actually be healed and lekin he was vachan tak hota hai jisne usse dekha unki aankhe phati reh gayi but the verse in verse 10 it says they recognized him as the same man who used to sit begging in the temple gate beautiful and they were filled with wonder and amazement Achha, at what has happened english mein acha nahi aaya meri bible bolti hai their eyes were broken unke uh, in hindi in hindi it is aankhe phati reh gayi unki aankhe phati reh gayi kabhi kabhi shabdon par dhyan dena bada zabardast hai it is good to actually focus on the word maine aise logo ko dekha hai jinko maine jab shur samachar sunaya to wo itne unme jab parivartan aaya to itne khush ho gaye ki wo khushi ko bayan karne ke liye jagah jagah batate phir rahe hain i had even shared some of the word with some of the people and when they received the christ their happiness and all they were so happy they were so amazed they just started going everywhere sharing the word of god aur jo koi unhe dekhta tha wo bolta tha inki aankhe phat jayegi unke aankhe phat jati and whoever used to see them they used to be amazed and their eyes used to be wide open brethren mai bhai aur mero mai ek baat bolta hu yadi aap kuch pareshani ke sath ji rahe brothers and sisters if you are going through some hard time mat bolie ye kaun hai jo yukti ko bigadta hai don't forget who is that person who is going to destroy the plan sab hamare sath kya hai plan a a bhi kaam karega to plan b a bhi kaam karega to plan c pata nahi kitne level ke plan hote hain the problem with us is we keep planning plan a plan b plan c if a doesn't work plan b will be mere paas is platform ke upar koi plan hi nahi tha at that platform i had no plans aur main ro raha tha wo plan kuch mil jaye mujhe and i was crying and hoping that i will receive a plan aur usi mein parmeshwar ne ek plan bola tu kaun hai jo meri yukti ko bigadta hai and then the word of god and the lord spoke to me and said who are you who is destroying my counsel maine tujhe kuch diya hai i have given something to you go and make everybody rich jao aur dusron ko dhani banao ja kar ke ameer karte chale jao maine to diya hai na tumko the word said go and start doing it now i have already given it to you kya aapko iske liye paise ki zarurat hai do you need money for this kya aapko iske liye achhi naukri ki zarurat hai do you need a real job for it kya aapko iske liye influence ki zarurat hai do you need influence kya kya ek achhi jagah par achhi post pe baithe hone ki zarurat hai do you need a real big post to do all this patras aur john to bilkul simple sa ja rahe the mandir mein prarthna karne ke liye peter and john they were just simply going to the temple to pray aur unhone kaha we have something and we want to give you this something they said we have only something and we are going to give that something ab mera challenge ye hai क्या आपके पास ये समथिंग है आज मेरे पास आपके पास टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू चैलेंज यू डू यू हैव दैट समथिंग विद यू कुछ जिसकी हम बात कर रहे हो है डू यू हैव दैट समथिंग दैट वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट यदि आपका साथी यानी जिससे आप मिलते हैं आपको देख के आंखें फट नहीं रही उसकी तो नहीं है if the if if you go to places and people see you and their eyes are not wide open you don't have that thing ये तो अच्छा शब्द यूज किए हैं वाइड ओपन नहीं हो रहा आंखें तब तो गड़बड़ है if people our uh, eyes are not wide open that means you don't have that thing aur yadi aapko milke wo bolte hain yaar kya kis bande ko mil jis aadmi ko mil gaya main kamaal hai tab kuch to hai and if people see you and say wow this man is amazing he has something special that Aap, means you have that something is something kon hai who is this something ye wahi something hai jo kehta hai i am the living water who can quench the thirst of you ये वो समथिंग परमेश्वर है जो कहता है जीवन की जो जीवन का जीवन का जल मैं हूं जो तुम्हें देता हूं ताकि तुम कभी प्यासे ना ठहरो आप ये समथिंग को देना पसंद नहीं करेंगे क्या आप चाहेंगे डू यू वांट टू रिसीव दिस समथिंग आप ये समथिंग को नहीं चाहेंगे मेरे साथ साथ चलता रहे डू यू वांट दिस समथिंग टू गो विद यू वेयरएवर यू गो जहां कहीं भी आप जाएं और जिस किसी को भी आप मिले वो कहे कि समथिंग तो है इस पे You want to have this something that wherever you go, people see and say, "Wow, this man has something." Do you want to? And the something that has happened to you is going to happen to the other person also. And the something that has happened to you is going to happen to the other person also. Do you want this to happen to you? Do you want this to happen to you? I am so excited. Let us all rise. I am proud of you. You are all 
कहेंगे मैं परेशान हूं मैं निराश हूं अभी हमने गीत गाया आई विल मेक अ वे हमने गाया अभी गीत गाया I will make a way when there seems to be no way. Yeah, you all might be thinking I don't have any way, but the Lord is saying I will make a way. But याद रखिए ईश्वर की चुक्ति को मत बिगाड़िए. But remember, do not destroy the counsel of the word. उसके पैरों पर उसके आगे चरणों पर गिर जाइए बोलिए प्रभु ये सब thing मेरे पास भी होना चाहिए. Let us go at His throne at His footstool and say, Lord, we want this something. वो देख करके बोले something इसके पास कुछ तो है. Let people say he has something. आप अगर परेशान हैं, हमने अभी अश्वरीकरण की बात की। अगर आपको लगता है अभी तक मैं अभी तक मैं चंगा नहीं हुआ, मैं कहता हूँ ये something में वो power है जो आपको चंगा कर सकता है। If you are going through something and if you are still mean you need healing, you have not yet received healing. I want to say you only need that something and it will bring healing. Actually, it is someone that we are talking about. Actually. वो है समवन वो परमेश्वर है जिसके बारे में हम बात कर रहे हैं वो यीशु मसीह है जिसके बारे में हम बात कर रहे हैं इट इज जीसस क्राइस्ट अबाउट होम वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट समवन दैट ब्रिंग्स समथिंग इन यू जीसस क्राइस्ट इज दैट समवन हु विल ब्रिंग समथिंग इन योर लाइफ हम चाहते हैं कि हमारे साथ भी हो जाए वी ऑल वांट दैट इट वी विल बी ट्रांसफॉर्म आई एम अपनी आंखों को बंद कर दस क्लोज आवर आईज हम अपने 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 आप को प्रभु के चरणों में ले जाएं लेट अस ब्रिंग अस बिफोर द हम प्रभु से कह देंगे प्रभु ये तो जो बीमारी समथिंग वाली है वो मुझे भी लग जानी चाहिए Lord, we want to say that this disease of having that something, I want to have it. Lord, I want to have that something in me. Prabhu, I want that you do that thing to me. Prabhu, if you need something, I want to do that thing to me. Prabhu, if you need something, I want to do that thing to me. Prabhu, if you need something, I want to do that thing to me. Prabhu, if you need something, I want to do that thing to me. Prabhu, if you need something, I want to do that thing to me. A fire needs to be invoked in me. Just have it, Lord. Prabhu, यदि आप चाहते हैं कि मैं जिस भी चीज़ में मिलूँ वो अचंभित हो जाए तो हो जाने दीजिए प्रभु. Lord, if you want that whomever I meet, they will be. My Lord, touch me, Prabhu. मुझे आज छू ले, Prabhu. Lord, just touch me today. Prabhu, आज मैं अपने आप को आपके ते आपके सामने ले आता हूँ. Lord, I just bring myself to you today. मैंने अपनी युक्तियाँ बहुत चढ़ा ली, Prabhu. Lord, I have made my own plans, Lord. Plan A को इस्तेमाल किया, वो फेल हो गया. Plan B को इस्तेमाल किया, वो फेल हो गया. Plan D को, Plan C को, Prabhu, अब और नहीं. Lord, I have made numerous plans and all have failed. और प्रभु मेरे पास तो सिल्वर और चांदी भी नहीं वो जोर और चांदी भी नहीं आई डोंट हैव सिल्वर आई डोंट हैव गोल्ड पर मेरे पास में वो हो जो समथिंग हो बट आई वांट दैट आई विल हैव दैट समथिंग दैट विल मेक द डिफरेंस कह दीजिए प्रभु जी लेट अस से दैट ये दिन आपका है मेरे प्रियो दिस इज योर ये बदलाव का दिन है प्रियो दिस इज द डे ऑफ रिवाइवल आप कैसी भी समस्या में हैं कह दीजिए प्रभु No matter which situation you are going to, इस लंगड़े ने इस लंगड़े ने जो जन्म से लंगड़ा था कभी नहीं सोचा। We know that lame person he had never accepted in his life that. लेकिन उसके बदलाव में उसकी चंगाई में एक मिनट का टाइम भी नहीं लगा। But it just took him less than a minute to be healed. ये वो उठ खड़ा हुआ चलने फिरने से बढ़कर के कूदने लगा। He started walking, not just walking. He started jumping and running around. Lord have mercy on me. Let us. परमेश्वर मुझ पर दया करे। प्रभु हम पर दया कर दे प्रभु लॉर्ड हैव मर्सी प्रभु मैं अपने जीवन को तेरे चरणों में लाना चाहता हूं लॉर्ड आई ब्रिंग माय लाइफ बिफोर यू प्रभु मैं चाहता हूं कि तू मुझसे काम कर प्रभु लॉर्ड आई वांट दैट यू वर्क थ्रू मी और तू मुझसे काम मुझ पे काम कर प्रभु लॉर्ड आई वांट दैट यू वर्क इन मी एंड थ्रू मी हां प्रभु और फिर मेरे द्वारा काम कर प्रभु एंड लॉर्ड आई वांट दैट यू कंटिन्यू टू वर्क प्रभु मैं चाहता हूं कि दुनिया मुझसे प्रभावित हो जाए लॉर्ड आई वांट द वर्ल्ड टू बी इन्फ्लुएंस्ड बाय प्रभु मेरे पास में धन नहीं है आई एम बैंक्रॉ Lord, I have no wealth. I am bankrupt. I don't have wealth even, oh Lord. Lord, मेरे पास तो पटुआ भी नहीं है. But Prabhu, मैं आज चाहता हूँ कि मैं दूसरे को धनी बना दूँ तो. But Lord, I want today that I may be able to make others rich. Oh Lord, use me, oh Lord. परमेश्वर मेरा इस्तेमाल कर. Come in my life, oh Lord. Change me, oh Lord. बदल दे परमेश्वर मुझे. Keep me closer to you, Lord. मुझे तेरे समीप ला प्रभु. Want to have walk with you, oh Lord. हे प्रभु मैं तेरे साथ चलना चाहता हूँ। Thank you Lord for listening। परमेश्वर सुनने के लिए धन्यवाद। In the name of Jesus we। यीशु मसीह के नाम में। In the name of Jesus we। यीशु मसीह के नाम में। In the name of Jesus we। यीशु मसीह के नाम में हम प्रार्थना करते हैं। We pray if anybody हम प्रार्थना करते हैं कोई बीमार है निराश है परेशान है वो आज छुटकार आ जाए। Lord we pray if anyone is sick if anyone is going through hard times he will find he will be Anyone is in debt today will be the day to be free. Prabhu, यहाँ पर हर एक व्यक्ति को आप छू लीजिए. Lord, touch each and every one in this room today. Touch Lord, छू लीजिए प्रभु. Touch Lord, touch each and every one. Let the fire of Holy Spirit fall upon them, 
बोला पवित्र आत्मा तेरी आग इस जगह पर गिरने पाए धन्यवाद प्रभु मैं सुनने के लिए धन्यवाद थैंक यू लॉर्ड फॉर लिसनिंग टू अस धन्यवाद प्रभु आपके पासवान के लिए थैंक यू लॉर्ड फॉर द पास्टर्स इन दिस प्लेस धन्यवाद प्रभु इस तरह से आपके चरणों में झुक जाने के लिए Thank you, Lord, that we have that opportunity to come before you. धन्यवाद प्रभु में शब्दों को आपने दिया translation के लिए और आपके लोगों को आपके counsel के बारे में बताने के लिए युक्ति के बारे में बताने के लिए. Thank you, Lord, for this opportunity for translation and all these things so that your word can reach each and every one. धन्यवाद प्रभु में remind कराने के लिए कि आप limitless परमेश्वर हैं. Thank you, Lord, for reminding us that you are limitless beyond boundaries. Okay, हम हैं जो हमेशा limit में रहना चाहते हैं. Lord, it is you who define our limits. प्रभु हम अपने प्लान बनाते हैं जो लिमिटेड प्लान होते हैं। Lord, we just make plan which is a limited plan. परंतु प्रभु आपकी युक्ति बन रखे हैं। But Lord, your counsel is beyond boundaries. हम प्रभु चाहते हैं कि वो हमारे जीवन में आएं। Lord, we want that counsel to come in our lives. प्रभु हम आपको धन्यवाद देते हैं इस अकुदम दो के लिए। Lord, we want to thank you for this amazing experience. आपके लिए बहुत बहुत हैं प्रभु। We want to say, Lord. Yeshu Masi ke naam mein karte. Yeshu Masi ke naam mein. In jinda nahi ho, Jesus we pray. Amen. 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 You may be seated, please. Thank you so much for giving me opportunity. Aap baat karte hain. Thank you, Pastor, for sharing the word of God.